Hello, Yarnabees. How are you? I have been asked by a few of you to do a tutorial on how I did the fringe on my Ruana. So I'm going to try this <laughs> and hopefully it will work. Okay, so you want to, I, I'm wondering, I don't know if I've actually put too many of these on or not, but we'll see. I have double crochets all along the top of, or the bottom of my Ruana. Okay. And what I've done is I've done two strands of yarn, whichever, whatever length you want, but you want to make sure that it's at least three inches long. Okay. And you're going to put it in like every second or every third stitch and just attach it all the way along. Okay. I'm going to bring you in a little bit and hopefully I'll be able to show this a little better here. There we go. Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to push these aside and just have the first two. Okay, now you've got four strands on each one. Okay, you're going to take the first two strands and you're going to put it aside. You're going to take these two strands and put them aside. Then you're going to take these four strands and you're going to figure out how big you want your space. And you're going to take them and you're going to just do a regular knot. Okay, but don't pull it tight yet until you know where it's going to land. Okay, so you're just going to slightly, slightly put it here so that's about the size hole I want. And then you're going to tighten it. Okay. You're going to forget about this for now. You're not going to use this until the second row. Okay. Then you're going to take the next set and you're going to split that set. Okay, then you're going to take the two that's from this set and the first two from this set and you're going to do the same thing and put the knot the same length or the same height as that one, which can be a little tricky. But that's why I say don't make the knot really tight at first. Okay, so you're going to go like this and you're going to pull it up and you're going to go, oh, okay, so that's about the right length. And then you're going to make it tight. Okay. And you're going to pull this over. Okay, again, take the next one, split it in half. Then take this one and this one, and you're going to knot these together. Okay, you're going to figure out about how far it is and knot it. Okay? And don't worry if it's not perfect, like it's a little bit lower or whatever, don't worry if it's a little bit. No big deal. Okay? Now you're going to take this one, you're going to split it. Take these two, and you're going to knot those two. And this is what you're going to do all the way to the end. Okay? Okay. Take this one, split this one. And knot this together. Okay. Okay. So you're just going to continue to do this all the way to the end of your Ruana. And when you're finished, I'll show you. Um, I'll show you what it looks like at the end, and then we'll come over and we'll start over again.
Okay, so I'll see you at the end. Okay, so this is what it looks like so far. Okay, so now what you're going to do is you're going to go back to the beginning. And then you're gonna gonna split them again, okay? Oops, here, bring it down here a little bit. Okay, so here's this lonely one that's over here. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go to this one down underneath the knot, and you're gonna split this again, okay? Then you're gonna take these two, you're gonna figure out about how far this one was and how far this one was or th this one's going to be and you're going to take these two and you're going to knot these two together okay and remember don't make it too tight until you figure out where you want to lay the knot okay so eh, probably about right okay Okay, so there you go there, okay? Then you're going to take this one, split these two, okay? You're going to do the same thing. You're going to take these two and you're going to knot them together, figure out how big the space is here, figure out from the knot down how far you want the space. Okay, so here's, oops, here's your first knot that you did, so you're going to want it around the same. going to take the next one. You're going to split these two. Okay. Now you're going to knot these two together. Okay. You're going to want it to be about the same height. You're going to want it, oops, to be about there. Okay. So there you go. Okay, take the next one, split that one in half. And then take these two. You're going to knot them together. You're going to do this all the way across. Okay. And there you go. Now you can make these as long as you want. And you can just keep doing this and keep doing this all the way down, right? But I just did like two rows, two different rows. Okay, take the next two. You're going to knot those. Do this all the way across. And that's what gives you your knotted netting look. Okay? And you still have tassel down here, right? So if you want to, you can, once you've finished all this, you can just cut it so it's all even or you can keep it jagged. You know, you do whatever you like.
Okay, and that's all there is to it, guys. It looks difficult, but it's really not. You just have to keep to remember to keep splitting to keep splitting your um, tassel, right? So if you were down here, say you wanted to go another one, right? Say you had more tassel here, and you wanted to go another one, you would just split this first one, split the second one and then knot these two together, okay? And then that one would be knotted. So you're going to split that one and put these two together. Okay. Split this one, knot these two together, and you just keep going, right? So that's how you do it. Ta-da! <laughs> okay guys so that's that's it that's all I wanted to tell you um, I'm going to be doing a another um, another I haven't even done one yet I'm gonna do a Ruana tutorial and this is going to be the bottom of the Ruana so I wanted to get this video out first before I did that so that you know exactly how this is done because I'm not going to put this part in that uh, tutorial. Okay, so thanks for joining me. If you have any questions, just email me or comment underneath this uh, video and I will get back to you. Okay, love you all. Bye!